Hi everybody, it's Bobby Joe again, and welcome to my home. I appreciate you all coming. Um, I have just, uh, well, I have a Joom and a Dollarama haul. I'm just, the Dollarama haul is very, very small. Um, the Joom haul, a little bit more because um, I want you to see some examples. So I'm hoping that you'll uh, bear with me a bit through uh, in these because I just want to see and want you to see what uh, is out there on Joom mostly for crafts um, and primarily for a die cut machine or an em em embossing machine. Um, now I'm going to just be going through dies that I've bought on um, Joom so far and um, what I'm going to be showing you um, are used, for me, they're used in my um, Big Shot, uh, Sizzix Big Shot, but I believe they're, they're, they're not Sizzix dies. They're um, your normal wafer thin dies. So we'll get into that a little bit more, um, but first for Dollarama, just a few quick things. Um, first I got quite a few of these and what I like these for, I'm just going to hopefully be able to keep that, um, so that you can somewhat see it. Um, these are the magnetic, um, photo sleeves and what I like about these, and I'll just quickly open one up here because it, it kind of has to do with the Joom thing because I had ordered some and, and was out of these little sleeves. Um, what they are, they come in two, essentially, to a pack. What I like about them is that first you have the mag uh, magnet on the back that any... any... Um, any that thin lip can go on. The other thing I like about it is that if you flip it over, you've got this little pocket that you can put um, stamps in. So if you have those stamps where you stamp it, color it, and then you cut it with the die, then these are really, really good um, for those. But at the same time, if I wanted to use them for another use, for instance, um, if I just wanted them for stamps, I have them for that option as well. The only thing I don't like about them is that if there's going to be di bigger dies, I can't foresee me ordering huge dies, but it, but I don't have the option of... of um, I'd have to put two of them together in, and stuff like that. So... Um, one uh, that's the only da downside. So you get two for a dollar twenty-five. It may not be a spectacular price, but for the convenience of having it from Dollarama, quickly, um, that's great. The other thing I got is this um, because you don't really if you're if you don't have sets of dies that you want to keep together, um, a simple pl a plastic bag will do honestly, um, for me anyways, but the main thing is, um, I do have some organizing I want to get done, um, as well, so a buck 25 for 36, I didn't think were too bad. And lastly, yes, I said lastly, um, for me, a Dollarama, um, these items are new to my store, and what they are are strips of these really interesting um, rhinestone, um, it, but not just the rhinestones, but the, uh, there's, the uh, in this case, gold. You can't really see it very well. Uh, well, I guess that's not too bad. Um, in this case, gold. Um, in this one, it's a little, it's a little less gold, more rose gold almost, um, maybe even a silverish gold. Uh, um, there were plenty of them there, really nice ones. 
two dollars a piece I'm gonna see first how well they work um, and for a set of four they even look like something that you could put around something um, similar to um, those rhinestone strips that you get from Michaels and stuff um, so anyways I'm going to try them out they look great though they look almost like jewelry honestly so um, but they had some white leaf there and they had silvers and stuff like that gold is more my color that I use the most though so all right so let's jump into June who introduced me to Joom is Tina. And <laughs> at first I'm, I'm thinking, mm, yeah, okay, I'll, I'll watch for a bit and see how she does. And then it just got better and better. And I said, okay, I'm going to order one set of things so and see how it is. It's um, It kind of showed me that, that some... <laughs> I'm I'm just happy. I'm, I'm just happy with the prices because you take and I'm going to just kind of pull out one set of dies here that um, I had already. So this set of dies is this little um, butterfly and this little butterfly. And I also had, I'm going to bring that one out too, I might as well. I also had this one, this layered, um, this layer, um, I'm going to move this up a bit, this layered um, flower. And it came in a set like that. And it came with the... Um, leaves as well that I regularly use also just get these out of my other there we go and and yes it, it it's they were very 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 good sets I love these sets the two of them however on Amazon um I probably paid $12 a piece, maybe, about. I, I, I forget now, but I know it was not $4 and $4, which is what they're on for with on Zoom. And I'm, I'm just going to put, uh, sorry, uh, totally off topic, just letting you know if you hadn't seen my other video where I showed a gorgeous pocket letter from Tina App. Um, my hands are filthy from working in the yard today. And yeah, I scrub, I scrub, I swear. Anyways, so these are very, these are beautiful sets. Gorgeous. I love, I can't tell you how many times I've used them because they were my first sets. Um, that I got with right after I got my machine. I, I ordered these with my machine, I believe. So it's, and then I find them on, and I even found a Tim Holtz one on there. Just the one, but it's the one with the squiggly lines that he has for um, um, Christmas, where it's kind of a squiggle tree and stuff. Even they're on there. Four, four or five dollars or something like this but I know this one was four dollars for the two butterflies and this one was four dollars and I can't tell you how many times I've used this one well use them both but this one big so I'm gonna put those aside those are just two things that you could get on Joom I didn't order them on Joom I got them off Amazon but two things all right, so these are, this is another flower that I got off Joom. I'm, I love my flower ones, so, okay. So this flower, I'm going to show you examples of these here in a moment. 
um, but this little flower set and I ordered those off June and I would have paid um, at the time they were three dollars for that set and Mario was in Michael's with me the other day and he said those sets are $14 I said they're not all $14 but they're pricey or can be pricey so if I can get this set and I've already used it a few times if I can get this set for three dollars score Keep in mind, Joom does not have shipping. I have yet to pay any brokerage duties taxes because it's coming in. It's under the $20 remiss. Uh, that's, sorry, I work for, uh, I deal with brokerage every day. So, um, um, remission, uh, courier remission. So they're under the $20 courier remission anyways, even if they, if they had duties, taxes, and brokerage. So, um, yeah. Excellent, excellent little set. And have used it a few times um, since I just received it not too long ago. This one is another little set. And what I liked about this one is not only do I have this, this little heart here, I have these two hearts that come with it. Now they're the stitched surround on these ones, but added to that is you can pop this card out, uh, this heart out too, and use it. So I've gotten four hearts, and this one cost, this one was $3 as well for four hearts. Two with the stitch, this one, and then the inside heart. Um, we're going to talk more about the intricate uh, dies here in a moment when I get into my examples though. Um, okay, and so another one that I received from June um, are the these little little ones. So these little ones cost these were three dollars also for the set. So um yeah. Um I really I I haven't used this ex like a lot lately like I haven't used it a lot um personally just yet um but doing my cards you can just imagine how awesome this is going to come out um keeping going okay this one just came in last night and i'm sorry i don't have an example for this one but um it's essentially the the um Christmas, I wanted to order early enough because I thought that these were going to take a long, long time to come in um, because June does have something like 72 days or something like this um, to get you the product. These all came within a month of me ordering. So this one here um, was the one that came in last night and I paid... Um, I paid three dollars for it alone. However, it didn't. It's not quite what they showed in the picture, so I was a little bit disappointed that way in it. Um, the in the picture, this outline wasn't there. So um, I will be leaving a comment about that. I haven't commented on this yet. Um, I'm, I am going to be leaving the comment because I, I was miss, uh, had I known there was going to be that outline, I probably would have ordered something different. Um, however, I can see, um, I do see examples on the, uh, on these and they look beautiful. They, uh, they really do. And I have plans for what I'm going to do and it'll look good on a four by six card for sure. 
it's just I it it looked like the leaves were all coming out here and stuff on it. It just looked a little bit different, but for three dollars, I'm not going to. I'm just going to make a comment, um, and but for three dollars, I'm not going to uh, make a a big large thing about it. Um, the other little thing, there's two more I want to show you, but one of them. Before I show you the die, I'm going to be showing you my examples. So just one more die that I'm going to show um, for the die itself. And look at that. And when you see the example of this, you're just going to be ecstatic. Those who love cats, of course. Um, so this one here, it's $3.00. That and to me, it's it's perfect. Um, and what I liked about them, what I liked about this little guy is the size. You can see I've got a big hand, um, and he is fabulous. He's fabulous. So stay tuned if you want to see him as an example. Now, my other example, and one of the things, I'm pulling these bags open because I haven't gotten my magnetic sheets from last night set up. So, this little guy, get, get a hold of this little guy. This little guy is one of the little, <laughs> look at that. Now, I made him a little 3D and stuff like that, but. Look at that. Look at the little feet on the bottom. So, um, they don't show him 3D. I, I just, I wanted to see him what he looked like 3D, so that's what I did. Um, the key to this little guy is he starts first like this. So, these little lines here tell you where to put his eyes and things like that. Then you have his little, so I'm just going to tear these uh, open here. So this little part comes and it's going to fit right on the, there. His, I'm going to move him up just a bit here. So maybe I should just right there and right there. Yeah. Um, and then these, um, now these have little spokes on them so that you can attach them to the back. So you can see on him, he, he doesn't have these little spokes here. But those go on the side. And then he's got his feet, his eyeballs, the balls, the next circle in the eye, and then the large circle in the eye. And these also, I on my very first one, I didn't realize they were the feet. And I use them for um, tufts up here. Also a really good thing. However, it comes with another thing as well. It comes with other things as well that you're just probably going to love. And that is a little scarf and antlers. So I made the little... Here's the little scarf for him. I didn't attach it, but I could. Here's the little, and then the little, the little um, um, uh, antlers. I like his antlers personally, since I made it 3D. I like his antlers like that. But the scarf, I could see adding to other things. Especially and the antlers as well. So I think there's different ways that you could de definitely do him, and I just love it. I'm I just loved putting him together. 
like a little miniature puzzle. And I'm going to find more of them because I just, for a little miniature puzzle, it, it, and it came out pretty good, I, I think. And I used colors that I'm kind of, I'm trying to get myself into the brighter colors because I love them so much, um, but I just don't do it. Now, this is listed as, <laughs> on, on the June site, Christmas Fat Bird Cutting Die. So, anyways, it's $5 for the whole set, which I thought, mm, yeah, yeah, we'll see what it's like. Love it. Absolutely love it. So, that is the first little um, example that you're going to see. So I'll put him over here. The next one, this is from the, 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 um, the heart. Now, on the heart one, like I, I mentioned, this is the inside heart. So that could be either used with this or it could be used without. Um, what I do like about it um, as well are the other heart, two hearts, which are, it's this one here. So you see it has the stitching the stitching in it and then the other smaller heart and it's got the stitching now this is um, this was I had a hard time with this particular um, um, uh, paper with this heart and I'll tell you why it's homemade paper um, it's very, very thick. It's not made by me, but it's very, very thick. Um, uh, Tina actually would, I sent some of this to Tina with some, uh, things. Um, very, very thick paper, very fibrous. So, Tina, if you're using your, <laughs> your, um, die cut machine, you may need to run it a few times. Now, you may say, wait a minute. Isn't that the the heart that she just showed us? Yes, I did emboss it onto this paper. Now, I do not emboss the correct way on my Big Shot machine, so I'm not going to tell you about how I emboss. However, I will tell you about the um, precision base plate. And the reason I need to tell you about this is because when you have an intricate die, there's some dies that you just cannot get every single little thing. And if you want them to just pop out really, really simply as you go around, sometimes they may even fa fall out. Use the precision base plate. Um, these are, you can tell I've already used mine. Um, the film that's over it is um, the older ones anyways. And, then, and this is like the, there's new chrome ones out. They're just not um, out really probably in... I don't know. I, 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 they may be on Amazon. I bought this one in Michaels. I used a 50% off coupon. Score. Got it for like 20 bucks or something like this. Um, this is the where it tells you the instructions. Um, and what it is, is under this piece of film is um, metal. And this is actually your bottom plate. So what you do is you take... You put have your you have your paper. You flip your die upside down. You put your top plate on, and then you have your um, you run it through as you normally would to cut dies. Um, but yeah, so 
um, but you need the intricate dies. Even it's still even recommended with intricate dies to um, have it. And then if you can do a quarter turn with your die as well, you so you bring it through the big shot. Big shot is the, what I the only thing I can tell you about right now. Um, but you run it through your big shot. You change the die or change the the whole sandwich if you want, but change the die just a quarter quarter turn and run it to, through the other t way, and that allows um, for the machine to the rollers to cut in a different spot to roll over the, the die a different spot, and that should get everything so that it just pops right out like it did for my kitty cat. Love, love, love this cat. Isn't he gorgeous? He's absolutely gorgeous. And this is just a quick light emboss where, where my cat was. Um, so really, really beautiful uh, dye for that one. Um, and of course, the little, and then when I use this with my butterfly, I will have less problems with it, I'm sure. I haven't used it yet, but I'm sure I'm going to have less problems. With these, um, with the, um, little flowers, um, those ones I didn't have any problem with. I could just pop those out. I just pop them from the bottom and just keep going up and um, they popped right out. And finally I just wanted to also show you, um, so those are the little flowers. They came out really, really well really different and this one is the small one and then I wanted oh and the slightly it's just small bit of embossing on the for the f small flower and then 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 I've got the look at how little small that is so that's the thing and I'm looking for the other oh I can't seem to locate it the other um, the example I had for this so I'm very sorry about that but yeah it's it's hanging out someplace um, so, yeah, that's everything, uh, all these um, from Joom. Uh, like I said, no shipping comes from China. Give it some time to, if you're, if you're like me, I'd rather save some money than, than, um, I'd rather save money and wait than to not. Um, so my, uh, yeah, it's, it's my preference. If you don't want to wait, you know, there's always, there's Amazon and, and, but what, if you're new to your big shot machine, if you're complete, I really, and I really, really suggest number one, I'm going to link a, a video that I suggest um, you read if you're new to a big shot machine or die cuts even. Um, if you're new to them and you want to take a look at um, a scrapbooking made simple, she has taught me so much and she has this weekly um, video on where she teaches techniques and shows products and 
it's I'm going to link though the video where she tells us the do's and don'ts of using our die cut. Um, she's who uh, suggested the um, precision base plate. Please, if you're going to do it, and I'm just starting to build my dies now because I really wanted to get used to um, my my big shot. And I want to, I'd rather be putting the money into the tools right now than necessarily um, the dies themselves. So the precision base plate was a big one. Precision base plate, the item number is 560320. Um, really good for intricate dies such as the one and then if you have this one where it's not the chrome one you just take a it's gonna put some things on you see my finger going through um, just take a baby wipe wipe it that's what she taught us so anyways folks I hope you um, saw something you might pick up on June and Tina you were asking about um, when you were going through my pocket letter you were asking about where I might have gotten my dies you can get these ones on June I've seen them um, so the butterflies and the the um, and the um, this one they are on there. I didn't buy them there, but they are on there. And it's a little depressing looking at the price when you've spent <laughs> probably double <laughs> at least. Um, but, you know, go and get a good deal, girl. All right. Take care, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. Bye-bye.